And we are back. Oh, you mean and welcome. My name is Shush Anime. Welcome back to Sakura Dungeon. Now, if you're wondering what's going on, this is most likely going to be the final part. I've been told in the comment section, thank you, because it just got to me in time yesterday after I uploaded part 28, that I am indeed near the end. All I need to do now is finish the ship and then go back to the throne room. And then I have done everything. That is literally it after that. And also, somebody, thank you. You told me about the sort button. Oh my god, look at that. It's so beautiful now. Oh, it's not all messy. <laughs> so thank you for telling me about that. I am so happy now that it's like that. I can tell what's where. Which is now amazing. So thank you for telling me that. Comment section. I'm going to have Chica... Uh, I'm going to have Chica at the back, actually, because the one I need to level up the most now is the Ryuo. Because she, right now, is the lowest level, and I need to really raise their levels. So I have indeed now done the first floor, unless I have not now unlocked whatever is over here. Door one open. Of course I haven't. Of course Yusha hasn't. Hello, demolitionist. I'm just going to beat your ass up again, because somehow I'm still alive in this game and making it through. I still don't know how I've made it this far. <laughs> I'm surprised I haven't died yet on one of these missions. Actually, quick question. Was there a time that I actually did lose in Sakura Dungeon? Is there a time where I actually lost a fight? I can't remember. If there was, then I'll shut up because I obviously uh, have made mistakes. And as you can see now, not much left. All I've got to do now... It's just go through here and go to the final floor. Oh my god, I can choose what floor? Level 3! That's the final floor! Of course I'm going there! There we go. Ah. Oh. oh, thanks. That's totally what I needed. I needed a lightning bolt the moment I got off the teleporter. Thank you. How did you know? Alright. I should have used a toxic bomb. That would have helped me out so much right then. But splash of water. Yeah, they're exposed. That was out of context. Bollocks. Uh, oh, come on. One off. Toxic pot. There we go. Now, she's gone. And she's going to be paralyzed. And my Rio is now leveled up. Lovely. <coughs> <coughs> I also needed a bit of happy time. For reasons, I just done Doki Doki and got a very bad ending. Or it was just set to happen like that and I couldn't do shit. I don't know. But I am very sad now. I am trying to record just to get over the pain. So if that was supposed to happen, it was supposed to happen. Also, my microphone is a tad bit louder than it normally is because of the reason that... Um, I would rather try and have it pick up as much of my voice as it possibly can rather than um, sound too quiet. I know the games can sometimes sound quiet as well. That's because it's hard to predict the volume levels for a game. So I apologize if that ever does happen. Intro to Renault. Intro to Renault. Raising security level to red. Looking down all for locking down all facilities. AI appears to be worried about us. I'm not really sure what a red security level is supposed to be. If she's worried about us, we must be going the right way. Come on, we have to be close to whoever's in charge here. Damn it, AI has obstructed us at every turn. A full security lockdown is going to be a pain to deal with. So that means we are now stuck. If you think a few shiny metal doors can stop me, then you are the true primitives. Red security level? It sounds like mayhem waiting to happen. I can't wait. Now that sounds more like it. Let's make a little chaos in here. Make them bring out their best warriors. Yeah. I swear. I'll start with these primitives now. <laughs> You're the primitive. You lost. They seriously think the onboard AI is a woman? Oh, yeah. Ab ab about that. And about these guys. Uh, <laughs> Hi, how are you? Oh, come on. Really? That's not, no, that should have hit. Triple slash. Oh, okay, that hit. That was lucky. And you missed. I'll splash you. 
and I missed. They're always going for the one on the right, never the ones that are the stronger ones, because they are coward primitives. They are the cowards here. Not me, not I, but they are the cowards. Because they refuse to attack the stronger forces. It's hard to believe, I cannot believe it. Okay, it was a good decision to do that. Astral Blade, goodbye. Lovely. And that was at 10. 149 man shots. Lovely, thank you. Alright, I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna have to swap them around much more frequently though. Cause if I'm right about this, things can go seriously wrong very quickly. Okay, it's not gonna be a space mimic, is it? Found a bundle of strange materials? Dispensing emergency carbon fiber sheets. Please take all take these materials to your closet fabricator. Oh no, we found another we found another um, costume, haven't we? Could you please explain what carbon fiber is, AI? I don't know what a fabricator is either. I looked down a bun at a bundle of strange materials in Seti's arms. Perhaps we should have a talk with Isabella. This must be the material that their suits are made of. Uh oh. <laughs> I think you're right, Yomi. For once, I think this is actually a good idea. Wait, what? <laughs> Hold on. Seti thinks this is a good idea. Sally, you have been corrupted to all hell. It appears to be highly resistant to damage. It's very light too. I think it'd be ideal for, for making armor. Oh, wrong button. Boop, boop. Ah, oh, fuck. You two just hiding in the corner the whole time. At least she's a level lower, so that makes it a tad bit easier. Give you a bit of a slasher rasher. Still missed a slasher rasher. You missed me because I'm floating. You're trying to get me wet, I see. Oh fuck! <laughs> <laughs> oh god, when a way to start off 2018. You're trying to get me wet, I see. What a qu guys, just quote it. I don't care anymore. Just quote it. For fuck's sake! <laughs> oh dear, guys, I'm sorry for that one. I'm, I'm honestly sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, why do I make things worse for myself? Find 149 mana shots. Okay, I'm gonna keep on saving because risk. We all know there's risk in this game. Let's go this way. Okay. I'm guessing this floor is going to be slightly bigger. I'm guessing the top one's going to be locked. So I'm guessing if it's on a lockdown, I'll have to go around the edges to then go through the middle. That's what I'm guessing. So I'm probably going to be doing this regardless of what I do. I'm just, I'm just guessing here, guys. J just for the second, I'm guessing. I have high resilience to air when it comes to Sylvie. <laughs> so Sylvie, splash her. Thank you. Good girl. And I would say oh, I'm I'm not gonna say anything because there was too much I can say on that one. Jesus, I'm not gonna say anything. No, I nearly said something even worse than what I said a second ago. And you're dead. There we go. 149, nine mana shards. Okay, uh, Emma, come back out. Thank you. Uh, I'm gonna have to face something regardless of what I do. This isn't even one of the battles, is it? It just drew me into a, a battle before anything actually happened. Oh, she's paralyzed and she still manages to. Oh yeah, one of you guys. I remember ages ago pointed out an impossible hit that happened to one of my characters. It had a zero percent chance of hitting any of my characters, yet it still hit. One of you said, "How is that even possible?" I don't know. It completely went over my head. I never noticed until somebody pointed it out ages ago. Oh, I don't remember when it was, but I think that was when I was halfway through the game. Oh, that was lucky. And of course you go for Emma, because everyone goes for the person who's the weakest. Oh yeah, I've still got Jim. I've still got my Jim with me, so I'm still okay. There we go, bringing it out. 
Oh, stop with the tornado bullshit. What is it with liking wind so much? Honestly, you're going to make it seem like you like queefing or something. There we go. Get out of here. 150 match. That was the battle. Oh, bollocks! I pressed the wrong button. No, I was supposed to press the Q to turn to my left to see what was there, and it was... Alright, I'm gonna have to swap the Rio out. Yep, I'm gonna have to swap the Rio out! No! Don't kill the Rio! They're gonna kill the Rio, aren't they? Yeah, they're gonna kill it, they're gonna kill it. No, dodge! No! You did a dodge! Damn it! Holy bolt, that should do some damage. Yep, it done some nice damage. Oh, yes. <sighs> Damn it. The Ryuo is now down. I Do I have any reviving bomb? I do not have any reviving bomb. Right. I should have probably have gotten some. I'm going to have to guard these either way, aren't I? Oh, there's none up this way! Wait, is there a direction where there's no battles to go through? Lovely. Ow. <laughs> oh, why haven't I done the bomb yet? That was pathetic. I'm sorry, but that that was. Be... Oi! Get rid of you because. No way did she survive. No, I'm not having that bullshit. Get out of here. Thank you. Why did that level up, Sylvie? Oh, there we go. That was easy. I leveled up Emma though. Alright, swap out Emma. For... I'm going to see what Cheek's like, because I've not seen Cheek yet. She can have another attack. Terrorize. Oh, I can replace skills. I didn't know that. Yeah, some bits you don't have to fight up. Okay, that makes it a bit easier, I guess. Right, so this is going to be a... Okay, let's see what you do, uh, Chica. Okay, you do a fair bit of damage, and uh, they, are, they are not resilient, which helps a little bit. Your durability, though, is uh, probably questionable. But she has S-Field, which is great. So you now have an Adjutin. Helping us fight. Alright, let me see your things quick. Okay, so she's got seven, seven, six, seven, seven, five. Yeah, resilience was low. Yeah, I thought so. Okay, she's got sneaking. She also increases your chance to escape by 20. Oh, wow! Wow, that is actually really handy. I. Didn't think she could possibly be that helpful if I needed to run away like a little bitch. <laughs> okay. Of course it's guaranteed for Chica. No one else. I don't know why I keep saying Chica and now I'm thinking of Five Nights at Freddy's. I'm sorry. We should never talk of that game. Alright, uh, Vitality. Oh, she doesn't need Vitality though. She needs a resilience! Oh, there we go. Alright, uh. Succubus, come out. Oh, there's a door right at the end I don't have to go through. Oh, it's the one. Scooter level is red, access to bridge denied. The bridge? What exactly is this bridge? 
I do recall hearing someone calling this flying object a ship. Presuming that the terminology is similar, then the bridge is where commands are relayed. So whoever is organising this invasion should be past this door. I remember some novels I read in the Elven Metropolis which describes ships which travel between the stars. I had no idea that such ships actually ex existed. I cannot wait to see what sort of person would command these soldiers. I couldn't really care less about the invasion, but I can wait to meet the but I can't wait to meet their commander. Oh, by the way, I am, I am, I might be drunk. I don't know. Gin is quite nice. All right, I like gin. Finally, maybe we can find some specialist at the East Grants. Jacob has her face to a palm. How did we? How did it take them so long to work it out? Besides, who are all of these different people working for that fox? The star planet is weird. How am I going to get myself out of this? How do we get in? AI has locked us out. This door doesn't have any slits for key cards either. Maybe there's a button then. Let's search this floor. Let's go here. Here's the button then. <laughs> I found the button. Press it. Security phone call. Bypassed. Unlocking door. There we go. <laughs> that was problem solved. <gasps> That was so easy. Why was this? Okay, facing three of them. Okay, this can actually be pretty nice for leveling up. So I'm just gonna do this myself. Because I don't think they can take us down that easily. If I take down the infantry first, there we go, perfect. Next, we take down the commander. I said, then we take down the commander. Thank you. That's when the stuff starts to get real. And plus, I think I am slightly overpowered with Selly. Let's be honest. Selly is an overpowered SOB at the second. It's obvious. Come on, she's got she's got stats up in the 11s, which is insane. And I've never thought that the stats could go above 8. As far as I was away. There we go. And everyone was at full health and everything. Lovely. Nobody level up though. So was that actually the way I had to go? Or is there another way? Let's go this way. There's a box. Large agility seal and large dexterity. Agility and dexterity. Yes. Large, large, large. We all love ourselves something large. There we go. Agility. 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 Why isn't that a rule? Uh, okay, I could give the agility seed to Chica. Dexterity seed, though. Oh, God, what is with everyone having the low dexterity on this bullshit? Give it to Emma. Sylvie, she's strong enough at the second. Let's be honest. She's, she's also overpowered. These guys, however, are not. <laughs> I laugh in their face. Wow, I've actually done a lot of damage. I wonder... Is there a level cap in this game? Like, uh, there is a Neptune. Is that, like, level 99 or something like that? Or does it keep on going forever? I'm actually curious about that now that I think about it, because I don't know if there's even a level cap in this game. There probably is, and I probably don't know. But how am I supposed to know if I don't ask? So if anybody does know, can you please let me know? Because I'm actually curious about that. And now I just realised that Succubus is... That's quite scary. And you're going to die. <laughs> and you're going to die. I should have poisoned the other one. That's still hit with 31% chance. Thunderstorm. And you're still here. Are you kidding? She's got no... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, for... Oh, for... Oh. Why did I do that? Why, 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 why? Why? How did... How, how did I miss? How did I miss that one button? How, look at the bullshit! How on earth could you have the odds of that? Such a... Fuck you. 
Guaranteed hit. Get out of here. Guaranteed hit. <sighs> the odds of hitting the succubus were so low, yet they always hit. Yeah, I didn't think I could use them. Yeah, they're not strong enough. Oh. Actually, I'll swap out the succubus for Chica again. Because I feel like she could be very, very helpful right now. In case I do have to do a runner, which I doubt I'll have to do. That could come across as me being cocky, but I'm just saying it as, as like, in general. I'm guessing I was right that I'd have to go up on both sides to, uh... Um... Get to the bridge because I'm guessing there's multiple buttons because there's two sides that are both open that both have a wave of enemies. So, if that's the case, and I do have this right, I cannot progress unless I press both those buttons because there was one on the other side. So, if that's it and there was only the one, then that must mean there's only one on this side as well. That is my line of thinking, so that's what I'm working off of. Missile launcher, what's this do? Oh, it's the same attack as him. I wonder if I can even catch any of these. I wish I could, but I can't for some reason. And also, if I have missed any of the characters to collect, please let me know because I will want to collect them all. I really do want to collect them all because I'll, then I'd feel like I've actually completed the game because it's taken me so long to do all of this. I understand why Lost Pools actually made it short because there's lots of games that Let's Players want to play. And I have a ton of games which I want to play, but I just don't have the time. So I can understand why he didn't play the whole thing, in all fairness, as a Let's Player myself. However, I wanted to do this myself because I've always completed all the Sakura games, so I just wanted to follow through with my own sort of determination. And funny enough, it sort of worked. And now, Seti is at level 67, and I reckon he shrubs. <laughs> and Sylvie's now a national, and she's dead. Woohoo! And huge, oh, huge resilience. Huge resilience shield. Seed. There we go. Yeah, there was one there. Oh, oh, it's in auto battle. No, no. No, no. I want to do it myself. I need to save soon as well because I haven't saved in a while. Oh, no. Please do not crash of all times on the last episode. So I will not forgive myself if that happens. Oh, yeah. I thought something would happen if I went to Anubis. Like, I thought that maybe if I go to Anubis, then maybe I could have some of her servants help me in battle. But I was a bit surprised to find out that that didn't happen. Because I thought it would be similar with the Ryuo after I asked the question. So, I have no idea if I can even get them. So, if I can, please, please, even though I said this in the last episode, please let me know. I am clueless on some parts, as you guys know. Yusha can sometimes be dumb dumb. Or actually, most of the time. I did not step into the battle there. Right. Terra. Okay, that didn't do an awful lot. But I'm doing a lot of... Wow, she, would... she really wasn't faced by that, was she? 19% chance. <laughs> Your attacks are weak against me. 11. Oh god, this is gonna be some. Oh, this is gonna be bloody. Get out of here. I'm so annoyed that it doesn't reach that um, Fox Girl's full health. I'm actually slightly annoyed about that. Because I'd hoped it would. Oh, let me just go back and get this because it's gonna. There we go. And that one. Of course. Because uh, we want to have a complete map here, don't we? Look at this. Almost got ourselves a complete map of the final floor of this entire game. Which is still insane to me to think that we've actually made it this far. I like the fact now that I have more area attacks, which is very nice. 
So that way then I can bring them both down and attack them individually with the with the powers that they cannot go against. Of course you can block poison, can't you? Little bitch. Uh, oh, Sylvie's... She's going all the way up every single time now. What's going on? Air cutter. Guaranteed hit. There we go. Stop kicking her. <laughs> when you just enter Astral and your buddy comes in and ruins everything, like... I'm going to move Chica to the back because I need to level up some of the other monsters. Otherwise, I'm not going to do very well. Because if I just keep it one-sided, it's not going to go well at all. And it'll actually pay against me rather than play for me. So I've got to be smart about this. I've got to have some food in a bit as well. I'm hungry. <laughs> I haven't had anything yet. It's like almost four o'clock. Um, all I've had is breakfast and maybe a few little snacks. So that's about it. Oh, Commander! I think you need some of this toxic bahom up with you. Of course, of course you do. No, I wasn't aiming for her. I was supposed to be aiming... You shut dumb dumb. You shut dumb. You shut a dumb dumb. There we go. I slash finish her off. There we go. Lovely. Okay. I now need to protect Emma. Get back there and swap with the succubus. Okay. Single slash. There we go. That hit. And of course, you're going to be a bitch by choosing that attack over and over again. Which is going to be infuriating as all hell. Because out of all the attacks, you have to choose that one over and over again. So, original. Oh, come off it! Bullshit! Complete bullshit! And now you weaken her. Great! Ah, oh, I love this game sometimes! Ah, oh, I love it! So, great. Gotta put Chica up front again. Thank you, Chica! Oh, I'm right in the top. Alright. Air cutter. Deal with that bitch. Deal with that bitch. And now she's going to try and deal with us, but we're going to deal with that bitch anyway. We're going to deal with that bitch. There we go. We're going to deal with that bitch. She's out of here. <laughs> what am I saying? Guys, I'm scared. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Yeah, dodge, dodge, dodge. Lovely. I'm so glad that she's now on our side now. Because she is probably the perfect enemy to go against these these fox girls. Go in here first. We have more supplies. It's the same as the other side. An elixir. Yes, I can revive someone. Ha ha ha! Yay! Yuja is happy now. One percent chance of hitting. If you hit, thank you. Toxic Bomb now, because uh, the more the merrier. Missile Launcher, because the more the merrier. Oh, she just doesn't want. She doesn't want to be part. Of, she doesn't want to be a part of the group, does she? Can't, can't believe youngsters these days. Lovely. She has now got nothing to attack with. She she was able to attack two people. Are, are you are you serious? With that little amount? There we go. She's, she had no way of defending. 150 mana shots. Right. I'm going to fill in the rest of the blanks. I said I will fill in the rest of the blanks. Why? Why are you doing this to me? I just want to finish this. I forgot to save as well. I'm an idiot. Oh no. You shall not back off. I sound cringy as fuck now. What is going on with me? Have I finally had my brain go snap and go put? Probably. Maybe. Not gone sexual though. There you go. Get out of here. That time it was able to go over 80. What the hell? 150 mana shots. Thank you. Okay. Save because I keep on forgetting. There we go. Yomi's level 60. You need to catch up, Yomi. Scrub. 
I'm going to stop saying scrubs. I'm sorry. And here we go. Another... Uh, another two little bitches to beat up. I know you guys probably say sometimes it's why do you abuse you, sure? Like if uh, some of you ever do comment that, even though you don't. It is, in a sense, but I'm still trying. Because if nobody stops these wipers, the world is doomed. So I have to. I'd stop it for Earth Chan's sake. Because memes. <laughs> there we go. Hey, that actually leveled me up. You kicked me and I leveled up. I am a masochist. Thank you. Find 150 match shots. Thank you. Press it. Security broker bypassed. Unlocking door. There we go. Hold on a minute, though. We. N mm -hmm. I just want to reach the bottom. Do I need to give these things some catnip or something to come off it? There we go. She's done. Now for you. Which you're the one I really don't like on this ship. She really had annoyed me over the time. And you keep on appearing out of nowhere. There we go. I've got him on level 67. That is nice. Ball lightning scroll. Ooh. Yes, I made it. Okay, there we go. There we do not go. <laughs> Bonk, bonk, bonk. Got to do a missile attack, haven't I, to get all these SOBs? You trying to do a holy stash on me? Ha <laughs> ha, joke's on you, I'm a satanist. Oh, wait, that doesn't work. Never mind, you should come up with a dumb idea and it didn't work. Hey, that hit everyone, lovely. Let's do it again, shall we? Do it again. 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 Lovely, okay, one more? Nah. Would have been too good to ask for. But it's actually going much smoother than I expected this time. There we go. There's one. She's resistant. I'm an idiot. Uh, let's have the Sagu bus come out. Slash her up. Oh, okay. 223 mana shots. Okay. Uh, let's see. I've got an elixir. Okay, I'll save that for when I get right. Security level, green, open indoors. Okay, we can enter through any side. Okay. Here we go, guys. Uh, I am actually going to use that elixir now because I think I will need it. So, use that bitch. And now, save. Because things go and get messy. And... Let's see. Let's I'm going to have the Ryo out first. Let's go. Just couldn't make a straight line, could I? Would have been too good to ask for. Would have been too nice. Damn it. And the Ryo doesn't have much to defend with. No. Don't hurt my dragon. Don't hurt her. Protect dragon. We must protect the dragon. And that's going to attack everyone. Because you're a bitch. And of course it hits the dragon on a minus 33%. How does that even happen? On a minus 33. On a minus 48. Thank you. You actually stuck to your guidelines that time. Jesus. There we go. Get out of here. Now you, love, can have some of this holy bolt! 6% chance of not getting a critical and it doesn't do a critical. I see how it is, gang. I see how it is. There we go. Defeated. Huge six. Oh, lovely. Dexterity seed. Dex. Feels appropriate to give it to um, Sylvie on that one. There we go. Here we go, guys. Well then, I'm kind of curious to see what sort of person would be strong enough to lead all of these spirits. 
Although I cannot really sense a strong presence. I think we should be careful before we walk in there. AI has probably already told her we're approaching. There might be a trap waiting for us. Good observation. I do not like this at all. I can feel nothing in the next room. The Dungeon Lord has overwhelming power. Whoever is in charge has nothing that can be detected. That is actually a little unnerving after you go through a whole series like that. So we had no idea what to expect on the other side. I'm kind of disappointed. I was expecting some extremely strong to be here. Oh well, at least the trash we faced along the way put up half a decent struggle. Well, she's just right, even though she was taken down by a one. <coughs> she had better not be disappointing. If she is, I'm going to do all sorts of things to her. I'm really keen. But at the same time, I'm scared of being disappointed. Let's just go in there already. The anticipation is killing me. Listen, you don't want to go in there. She's definitely taken that thing out of storage by now. What thing? What are you talking about? I can't really put it into terms you would understand. But if you go in there, you're not going to like what you find. We're going in there. And this definitely looks like the pot. Okay, barging, it, barging into another room, we looked all around us. Well, this is the bridge. If it is the bridge, then where is the commander? Right here. Who's the commander? Oh, hello! You look like you could put up a fun fight. A woman with a strange banner attached to her back approaches us. What appears to be bizarre metallic wings float next to her. What is this outlaw doing with you? Surely you didn't fall for her lies and let her out, did you? The woman just shakes her head. They forced me to work with them. These people are the worst. You've always been a bad liar, Chica. It's the truth! Yes, she's actually she's actually telling the truth for once. <laughs> yes, just like how you saved the galaxy by plundering the matriarch's royal treasury. But alas, I could not care less about you at the moment. The last thing I was expecting was the primitive planet putting up decent resistance. Our technology is far superior to yours, and yet you're still able to defeat my soldiers. But this will not delay the invasion. Yeah, why do you want to invade? That's the number one question. Why do you even want to invade? What does this world have to offer you that you cannot find back at home? Things are in turmoil back home. We set out across the stars to build a new future for ourselves. Your world is ideal, it's full of energy, primitive inhabitants and natu natural resources. In addition, its atmosphere is nearly identical to our own. So we would like to claim this world as our own. We won't let you do that. Does no matter what technology you can't, we will prevail for we are defending our homes. We are fighting for our planet! We are fighting for earth -chan. You sure do seem confident for someone so weak. How do you expect to defeat us when we cannot even sense your power? So you're in charge of this invasion? The succubus licks her lip. Now you're going to be a tasty one. Uh, I'm not impressed. I might as well just turn around now. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, ouch, kabibble. It's obvious that this invasion is over. Listen, everyone. Those metal wings she has, you must really leave the room right now. We aren't leaving. What choice do you all have except to bow to your bow your heads? I, Commander Hiroko, will el eliminate you myself. Then there will be no one left to resist our invasion. I have come a long way in my travels, Hiroko. My subordinates aren't to be underestimated. Neither am I. Voice rings out from her strange metallic wings. Hello. Weapons fully charged. Titan weapon system online. Fully charged? Titan weapon system? Uh, I'm not going to do attack on Titan. I'm not doing it. I was distracting you while it was charging up. Running diagnosis. Diagnosis complete. All weapons nominal. Oh great, here we go. Why didn't you just beat her sentence instead of wasting your time arguing with her? It's not as if we knew what she was doing. Yet yeah, you knew, you could have told us, Chica. You could have told us, but you didn't. Now that I'm fully charged up, why don't I introduce you to the TWS? The Titan WS. The single most powerful weapon created by our civilization. Ideal for destroying enemy infantry. It doesn't matter how strong that weapon is. We shall prevail no matter what. Yes, we will. You don't even know what this weapon system can do. So let's see how you fare against this. Target locked. Prepare to fire. A strange chiming echoes through the air. Okay, she's level 70. We can do this. She's floating. 
Ah, bollocks. Ah, great time to level up. Okay, uh, yeah, hit her with the ice. No. Hit her with the wind. She's floating, of course. I, I should have known. I'm not hitting anything. The Ryuo is going down like hell. How did that not hit? I don't know. Ooh. Oh, it's an, it's an all area attack. Have this then. Take the poison bomb and eat it. She's paralyzed a bit though, that's good. Oh, this floating bitch. This floating bitch. I'm gonna just have to keep hitting her with the bomb. Are you kidding me? Combust her ass then. Why is she dodging so much? Is my only question right now. She's dodging so much bullshit. Okay, now she's getting damaged. Alright, that's attacking everyone. But, Seri and Sylvie are not going to go down easy, regardless of what goes on. Or what even happens, Berserk. Come on. 70%. That was guaranteed. Come on. Bring her down. 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 That didn't work. Damn it. Okay, I'm, I'm doomed. <laughs> oh, no, Emma. All right, Chica's now out. That's good. Oh, I don't know yet. I don't know if she has anything extra. She's all the way at Astral Level 8. What? Why did she do that? I didn't even notice that. I, I'm just going to go mono and mono. Are you serious right now? Are you serious? You won't even let me get a hit? You, you're not even going to let me get a hit, are you? You're just going to let her go all the way back up to the amount that she was at. Single slash. Well, a percent chance and that worked. Why? Come on. Yes. Come on. She's nearly... Uh-oh. Here we go. Here's the BS shot. And it still missed. Uh, some. Come on, hit. Oh, come on! Hit, there we go. She's done. Gone. We did it. We found 500 mana shards. CPU core has been damaged. Titan weapon system is now offline. What? A Titan weapon system has failed? Yeah, that was much easier than I expected it to be. You're just a bunch of primitives from a backward planet. Wow. It shouldn't be possible. Judgmental much. <laughs> you underestimated us. <laughs> you used that weapon as a crutch. Never can defeat hard work. Here the code pulls out a weapon from inside the TWS, as she called it. Eat this. Wait, what? A flash of light launches from the weapon. Cheap trick. Siri deflects it with her blade. Hero kick kick's fine, only for Sally to easily evade or parry it. Soon we hear a clicking noise. Damn it, out of ammo! She throws the weapon away. Well, that's it then. You've won. Hiroko bows her head. We just wanted a new home. Why didn't you just ask then? Yeah! Why did you have to go to such effort just to murder us? What do you mean? If you want a new home, you don't have to invade us. I practically own these lands and there's plenty of free space. So I want to just settle here peacefully. I expect Seri to immediately protest. But strangely, she's kneeling down next to Hiroko. Oh, hello. I don't understand much of what I've seen today. Oh, bollocks, I clicked off the game. <laughs> <laughs> a woman's voice living inside a metal grate. Doors which open by themselves. Okay. I'm going to save just in case that actually does mess up everything. Okay. I don't want the corruption to happen now. Someone calls called flu season. Something called flu season. And then, and these strange things called key cards? But what I do understand is what it's like to be so disillusioned with your homelands. Now you just want to leave. Hiroko looks up at Seri. If you want to stay here, we don't drive, we won't drive you away. I never expected something like this to happen. If, if it not bother you, you would like to stay. <laughs> you see conflicts sorted. Yes. Then you're free to stay as long as you like. Just don't cause any trouble. 
some of the troops here won't give up on the invasion plan right away. So you won't be safe even after this agreement. That's fine, we can handle ourselves. Despite herself, Hiroko is smiling at us. It's a promise then. I like how... Oh, oh, damn I like how the hands of um, Seri and uh, Hiroko are almost like they're actually connecting. I like how I like how you tried to do that. We will settle here peacefully. In fact, we are even willing to share your technology with you. We will uplift your civilization if you so wish. I do not quite understand what uplifting means. Basically, we will raise your civilization's technology to be on par with ours. No, no, that is not necessary. We will get there eventually, I'm sure. Hmm. And interesting, as interesting as all of this is, I have to agree with Yoni. I think he was too strange for me to comprehend. It is pretty cool though. Very well then, I will try to spread the world. The word, stay safe in the meantime. Don't worry about us, Hiroko. We'll be fine. And we done it. Ha <laughs> ha, Titan weapon system, I got an achievement. I'd use the warp gem. Right. Oh yes, I've got the I've got the um clothing. Let's go. The materials we required from the spaceship, as they called it, are fascinating. Carbon fiber sheets, they called it. Welcome back, my humble master. It seems you entered the mysterious object and came out in one piece. Not only that, we've been doing some looting. Showing the materials to Isabella, she looks at it with a wonder. I have never seen anything like this before. She pulls out a knife and tries to poke a hole in them too. It won't go through. Whatever this, this material is, it resists stabbing. Sort of like chainmail. She tries to cut it then. Also resistant to cutting. I've managed to cut through it though. Yes, but your sword arm would be exceptionally stronger than mine. Whatever this material is, it would make for exceptional armor. Isabella seems to be ex getting excited. Give me some time with this, my humble master. I need to work out how it's made before I can do anything with it. Okay. Have all the time you want, Isabella. After some time, Isabella seems to work out how the, to replicate the material. Hey, there we go. Yeah, the material seems to mould itself perfectly to your form when you've put the suit on. Not only that, but it's quite stylish in its own way. Well, it's, she's right, though. Aren't you happy, Seri? We finally made a, you a practical outfit. Practical enough, I suppose. It's comfortable, light, resilient to attacks, and creates no drag on the body. What more could you want in armour? Does that actually help us? No, there's no more to do with Isabella. That's Isabella done. Walk around town. We can't do anything around town. Do you know what that means, guys? Only one thing left to do, and that's go back to the Shrine Throne. Because if you guys are right, there's something else I need to do back here. Alright, I'm going to put the Rio there for reason. So let's go back here. The Rio is exactly where we left her. I did lay in the round, lying around for certain servants to tend to her. Nice of you to visit me again, but I think you might have better things to do. Oh. Inquire about the remaining pockets of resistance. How have how have how have clean up efforts been going? Is there much resistance left on this floor? There's a prominent group of Mikos who refuse to submit to you, Dungeon Lord. They say that they have a sacred duty mandated to them by the previous Dungeon Lord. But we are slowly capturing them one by one. It's then that we hear banging on the door to the Rio's palace. Whoa, hello. Let me in. I need to speak with Rio. Oh, now who could be knocking so desperately? Ah, ha, hello. Amigo bursts into the room, looking really worried. Oh, the Dungeon Lord is here. Good, we need your help right now. Is this one of the Mikos you were talking about? Yes, quite annoying, aren't they? Forget about our petty conflict. Dungeon Lord, please listen to me. I am listening, please calm down. What do you need from me? Uh, okay. We Mikos traveled on hand to steal the next size evil. I'm sure you know this. Right. And what does this have to do with me? Oh, no. What's this have to do with me? Before you came, the former Dungeon Lord had found something. Something? Somewhere in these depths, there was a terrible ancient evil inside an abandoned room. So she sought out as many Mikos as she could. Together we have been holding this evil at bay with our charms and seals. But the previous Dungeon Lord defeated and our numbers dwindling, our seals are beginning to fail. It's now only a matter of time before this evil escapes from its prison. Please, Dungeon Lord, you are the only one who can defeat it now. Rio seems intrigued more than afraid. Powerful evil, is it? So 
Sounds like it could be a fun to fight it. Please don't underestimate this threat. Whatever it is, whatever is in there has enough power to cause a cata cataclysm. Whoa. That will devour these lands. Now that sounds like something worthy of my time. I just restored order to my dungeon. The last thing I need is an ancient evil ruining my hard work. Please show me where this abandoned room is. It's not connected to the dungeon's main structure. You have a secret network of tunnels which lead to the room. You have a town on the surface, right? I will take you from there to the room of seals when you're ready. Don't think you're leaving without me, Yomi. Of course. Please come with me, Miko. We will go to this room of yours soon. An angel leave is stirred somewhere in the depths. Talk to the Miko Fox in town when you're ready to stop it. Okay then. So that that is what you guys told me about then. Right. Um, the reason I'm saving so much is because anything can happen. Go to the room of seals. Let's go. We are ready, Miko. Please show us the way to this room. As you wish. Please come to the teleporter. Ah, we're here. Okay, let's go. Through roughly hu hone tunnels we walk, leaving behind the dungeon. Steady seems especially nervous. I was never fond of ancient evils. This entire place feels strange too. That's its power leaking through the seals. This entire area might as well be haunted. Well, it's draining, remain, draining to remain here for too long, which is why we have to retreat back to the main dungeon. I, I see. We're almost there now. We see a rough doorway ahead of us. Oh, so this is the final room. Now this room makes me feel worried. There are seals practically everywhere. The walls are plastered with protective charms and the smell of warding incense permeates the air. Permeates the air, sorry. This is it. The evil is sealed inside the altar, you see. Fox Miko is visibly trembling. Listen, in order for you to fight it, I'm going to have to release the seal. It won't be at its full strength when released, so that's the only chance you'll have to beat it. On top of that, once this escaped, there aren't enough Mikos to be able to seal it again. So, so if you're going to do this, I want you to be really, really, really sure that you can beat it. I can help but let a grim look settle on my face. Sally notices it too. We only have one shot then. Pretty much, we have to do this. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Yemi, I will trust your judgement on this. Very well. Merely looking at the seal is enough to make me feel apprehensive. Release! Do it! The Miko begins to chant her nerve. Chant. Alright, I'm gonna say there. In case I do fight wrong, and this will possibly be my first death. The Miko begins to chant, her nervousness making her stammer. As she speaks, the orb and the altar begins to rattle and shake. Sede steals, steals herself, her sword drawn. I can help but brace myself too. There, it's done. I, I will stay out of the way for this battle. The orb rolls off the altar, shattering on the floor. Who's in the orb? Oh, hello. Who are you? Oh my. She's even wearing it as a tie. Why does she remind me of Sea Viper from Street Fighter? She honestly reminds me of Sea Viper a little bit. Or Rose the Witch. A strange woman with a number of seals plastered over her body appears in the room. She looks around her, curiously examining her surroundings. Finally, I am free. I knew they could not hold me back forever. She notices us standing in the room. Are you the ones responsible for sealing me? Not at all, but we are the ones who will be responsible for defeating you. She lets out a loud, mocking laughter. <laughs> How do you plan to defeat me? Do you even know who I am? The Mikos did not exactly describe who you were to us, no. I'm Izanami, the great calamity even the gods could not quell. This land has proposed, prospered in my absence, but now it is time for that prosperity to end. We won't let you do anything like that. And we say that in spacesuits. Then prove it. All around us we begin to feel her terrible overwhelming power. Let us battle then. Your deaths will mark the beginning of a new era of despair. Level 7. We can do this. This, this is... Tornado. She has to have this move as well, doesn't she? Ah, yeah, yeah. I've had it up to here with that move. This move is... This battle's going to be easy. I don't see why you guys were so worried. You just got this in the bag. Look. Done. <laughs> oh no, she's got dual so. Okay, I can see what you guys are on about now. I am a terrible. No matter if I am sealed, defeated, or even erased from existence, I will always return. 
is Amaze activated a dual soul ability. So she's at half her health, and she's going to drop 25 health. Is that it? Is that all you did to me? You're trying to go for the strongest. And you're succeeding. Holy God. Um. Uh, Emma? Take a shot, please. <laughs> and she's attacking everyone now. Okay, I can see how this is going to go. I had to swap Seri out then because I did not want the risk of Seri going down. Because she is the most powerful one. If she goes down, I could be in a lot of trouble. A second to the... Oh, she's got E-Skin. Oh, no. I did not know that. I'm waiting for her to also get rid of her Astral. Because the moment she does, I'll have a chance. The Succubus is out, so that means I also have a better chance. And Sylvie's now in Astral as well, which is also great news. Fire Slash, that I still missed. Holy Bolt. Please hit. Damn it. Ooh, I hate that sound. I hate that move with that sound. Alright, now I need to keep her at bay. That's what I need to do the most. Come on, Holy Bolt. There we go. Damage done. Oh, wind. Yeah, she's got E-Skin, E-Skin. Uh, fire Breath. There we go. Right, so now I need to do a water attack, and that'll be much better. There we go. Oh, come on. Single slash, do it! Ow! Oh. Just a shot will do it. Yeah, there we go. You guys worry too much about me. I done alright. <laughs> Although, I say that now, probably die. 500 mana size. Izanami collapses, unable to continue fighting. So it seems I'm no longer the strongest in this land. The world has certainly changed since I saw, last saw it. I know how you feel. I was sealed away for several hundred years as well. Why are you sympathizing with Nay? I am one of the most ancient evils in the this world knows. I know that was supposed to be me, but I was just following through. You're a woman before anything else. I won't go over and sit na next to her. Now that you've been weakened, what do you think comes next? You destroy me, of course, or see me away. There are the only ways to stop me. Nonsense. You barely have the strength to stand at the moment. It'll come back to me eventually. Why is that you want to destroy the land anyway? Yeah, why? That's my purpose in this land, this world. I am the embodiment of entropy, the counterbalance of creation. It's then that the fox Miko enters the room again. You actually did it. Well, Miko is into the room, pulling out paper seals. Let's seal her again. Let us seal her again. She will not trouble this world again for thousands of years. I have another idea, Miko. What? I turn to Izanami. How would you like to have a magical contract? Whoa! <laughs> the fox Miko immediately panics. You can't be serious, Dungeon Lord. Even if you can control Izanami with a con, even you can control Izanami with a contract. She needs to be sealed away right now, before she has a chance to recover. Izanami seems bemused. You somehow think you can control me? Well, it is worth a try. At the very worst, we could go back to beating you senseless and stuffing you inside an orb again. Yeah, we got a point. <laughs> very well. I accept this contract. No, you don't know what you're doing, Dungeon Lord. This is Izanami, the Great Calamity. A being so dangerous that even the heavens cannot fully restrain her. Oh, shut up. She will destroy the entirety of these lands. Not if I restrain her myself. She will remain in this room in the middle of all these seals. Well, we cannot do anything to stop you. But if she breaks free of your contract, what happens next will be your responsibility. I am willing to accept that. You are a very interesting woman, Fox. Perhaps this contract will be worth it. <laughs> We've had talks like this before, Yomi. Even though I agree with the Mikos here, I'm sure you can keep her in check. Do your best. Well, dear. We should head back for now. Before we leave, I'll pick up a bundle of loose seals and ropes. Now, whatever could you want with those? Oh, nothing. Oh, hold on a minute. What are you doing, Yomi? You found a bundle of talismans. Why? Why did I need that? Why did I need that? It's strange. I was expecting peace after I reclaimed my dungeon. But it seems like conflict simply follows me no matter what I do. An ancient calamity is lying somewhere in the depths below me. A fox spirit from another, and fox spirits from another world have started their new lives here. But it has not been boring at all. Well then, 
The dungeon is more or less cleared for now. There's only a few pockets of resistance left, and I'm sure your subordinates can handle that. Will you be going back to your guild to report your success? No, stay! Come on! It feels too bad to just end her off right now and just say, nah, I'm gone. I'm sure they will shower you with riches and fame. Eventually I will. There's no rush. For now, we should enjoy this piece while it lasts. Sounds like an excellent idea to me. Maybe it's a good time to go travelling. Maybe it is. Is that it? Is that it? Now then, an inevitable part of bloody horrible battles is that your armour is going to get damaged. When that happens, just come see me. Of course, I can't do it for free. Give me the necessary materials and I'll have your equipment repaired right away. Pair three outfits. Wait a minute, did it raise the difficulty? Is there anything else to explore? No? Is that literally it? Like about my humble master? That is it! I finished! There's nothing else! Oh my god! There we go guys! Circle of Dungeon is finished! After such a long time! Let's have a look at the first day I'd done this. Back in March I played this! And now it's the new year! It nearly took me a whole year! To do all the Sakura Dungeon. And now it is done. Yes. So there's not much I can really say guys. This was amazing. I loved this game so much more than I expected. And I hope you guys loved it too. So not really much I can say. I don't thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you want any more from me. And I shall see you in the next video. So yeah, guys. I'll indeed see you next time. Wow though. Next up, Nova! Never mind. I just realised something. I just had to look at my inventory quickly and realised that those seals could be used for a costume. Are you kidding me? Isabella, I have some interesting materials for you to work with today. Do you show me, my humble master? I think you should reconsider this, Jamie. I hold out a bundle of cursed seals to Isabella. Are you sure that this is a good idea? Even with my skill, I cannot ensure that these seals won't affect you. It's alright. I have made a contract with the owner of these seals. No harm shall come to me. If you say so, I'll have faith in you, my humble master. Oh my god. Oh my god! <laughs> now this is more like it. Oh, ugh. Wind has come to me. I do not understand your reason for turning these materials into an outfit. I simply thought it would be a nice memento. Either way, I am really liking this outfit. Is there something there is something alluring about it, especially when you're wearing it, my humble master. That's also due to your efforts, Isabella. There we go, complete wardrobe. I have got every single, every single costume. Holy shit, there we go, now it's the end. <laughs> well, there we go, guys. I thought it was over, actually, before I end it off, let me have a look again. Must key card. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I have missed something. Hold on a minute, guys. It's not over yet. I just realized something. There's a room up here I have not been in. Can I go in here now? Door won't open. Oh, come off it. No. There's got to be a way in there. You can't be serious. Wait a minute. Maybe there's... Maybe there's a way. Maybe, there, is there a way to unlock the door? I might have to look this up in one sec because I want to do everything now. I don't want to leave anything blank and that's the last thing. That is literally the last thing. So bear with me a second. After I finish this battle, I'm going to have a look myself. Be right back, guys. There we go. Be right back. A larger... Now it gives me an agility shield seed. Are you kidding me? I still can't use it. I can't use it anyway. <laughs> I think I know what that is, guys. Hold on one second. I think it's another teleporter. So if I use this and go over to the other side. I am now in here. Security level green. Opening door. So there was no secret there at all. That was it. That was literally all I missed. I've, n I've now done everything. See you later, guys. <laughs>